sometimes the only thing you need is a bit of luck and a lot of patience. This is Mark from Tarantuhala. I am happy that I can finally compile this video that is pretty long in the making since some of the footage is a bit dated and old. It was taken in summer 2022. I haven't even thought about the YouTube channel back then. In summer 2022 I went to a pet expo in Rybnik and I saw a male Psalmopeus irminia. I took the opportunity and got him with the intention to pair him with my Psalmopeus irminia female, which I believe by that time was already mature. So I took them, put the male in the enclosure and nothing really happened. The female rejected the male she wasn't attacking him, she was kind of in a defensive stance, but nothing really happened. So I took him out, gave them some time, tried again, also nothing happened. I believe it was about a month later the female molted. And I was just thinking, nice, <laughs> the male will probably die of old age and no slings. I was hoping everything will be all right. I fed the female and gave it another shot. The male was a little bit wacky because I had sometimes the thoughts that yeah, he wasn't really he wasn't really doing his job because I wasn't sure if the if the male mm, how to say it hit the target. Yeah, that's probably the most neutral way to, to tell that. So I gave it a couple of tries after, of course, feeding the female. And yeah, the male died. And I thought, yeah, that's it. There will be no slings. But after some time, I saw the egg sac. I was really happy. We got this, we will have slings. So what happened after that? The female was not fed during that time. There was probably some misting of the enclosure, but that's it because yeah, she was keeping the egg sac. And I was checking from time to time, I believe twice in a week. One day we noticed something very strange. It looked like the female abandoned her egg sac. So yeah, some really dark thoughts came to mind that there is absolutely nothing inside. So I took the egg sac out and I couldn't believe my eyes. There were lots and lots and lots of slings inside. So today is the 19th of March. I was just feeding an army of slings when I noticed that the Psalmopeus irminia, which we paired for some time, was walking outside. What is curious, she was having an exec and she was walking outside without the exec. So there are two possibilities. First, she ate the exec or second one, the exec hatched. So I just want to check out if everything seems all right or if it will be a catastrophe for us. So yeah, let's check what's going on here. Well, the exec is still here. I don't see any slings. I think we need to check, we need to check that out, we need to check the exec. Here we have the enclosure for the Psalmopelus Irminia. Okay, um, the exec is right here, the plan is to grab the exec through this webbing, so let's try that. Got it. Got it. I have it already. 
Here's the exec. Okay, this doesn't look promising. Let's try to check what's inside. Oh, we have slings! We have slings! Look there! <gasps> we, have, we have slings, we have tiny, tiny slings here. Guys, I'm shaking. <laughs> Jakie słodziutkie. Mm -hmm. Patrz jak uroczy się ruszają. Mm -hmm. Maleństwa. Zastanawia mnie, czemu ta matka porzuciła ten kokon. To są już nie w drugiego stadium, no nie? Tak. Okay, first of all, I want to check how many of those eggs are fertilized and I want to separate the <laughs> the walking spider links from everything that should not be there. I will put them on this little tray here and this one goes straight into the incubator. So let's go. <laughs> like little toddlers. Okay, I'll start counting. One, two, fifty-one, fifty-two. 87, 88, 102, 103, 104, 105, and come on, 136 slings. <laughs> it's always a pleasure to see how tarantulas breed and yeah, how they have offspring. <laughs> they are so cute. So yeah, here are the slings, 100 34 if everything is all right one of them passed during the molting I believe but the rest of those they look absolutely healthy let's rehouse them I am not sure how to do that with this amount of spiders <laughs> Yeah, this will be this will be a fun this will be a fun experience. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is it tak dużo? So here we are at the tricky part. We have two incubators full of little Venezuelan sun tiger slings and we need to get those into those here I have no real strategy and this is this is definitely a problem Number one, this, has, this will have a honorary place. Every one of you, give him a name, right? <laughs> to be honest, I thought this will be a bit more difficult since, yeah, some of these can be quite fast, but they seem pretty, pretty chilled. Now at the close-ups you don't cooperate. Thank you. There we go.
Oh, here comes the next one. He's very curious. Come on. <laughs> they are awesome, right? <laughs> Okay, he's scared, so yeah, let's give him the, the home he, he needs right now. Let's see if I can, if I can handle free at the same time. Oh no, oh no, get back there. Okay, no, escape here, escape here. No, 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 no. Uh, support. I believe this will be a bit trickier. Oh. <laughs> this, this looks like a creepy puzzle Oh my god, that's a bit of a That's... No, that's beautiful Where are you going? No, don't there! Don't go there! <laughs> The last two spiders. Oh. We are done. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 133 and the last one 134 tarantulas. So no deaths among the slings. <laughs> a nearly golden egg sack if that one small N2 sling wouldn't have died it would be a perfect one everything was fertilized so as you can see we managed to rehouse a lot of tarantulas today I'm so happy that after such a long time I mean I started trying in summer last year and finally I am sitting next to the offspring of my Venezuelan sun tiger. I think the biggest lesson I get from this is be patient and take your time. If you like what you saw consider subscribing, ring the bell, leave a comment what you like, what you want to see and don't forget to drop a name in the comment section and to, to leave a vote which name you like. The two biggest upvoted comments will be the names of those two spiders which will stay in my collection and will extend the bloodline of my female. So yeah, thank you for watching. Tarantohala out. Oh boy, this all will need to be fed.